In this video, you will get to know five new species that recently discovered by humans. Welcome to The Weird Side. It's a channel about unique creatures that not many people are aware of. There are so many great wonders in this world. Even human beings who have existed on the Earth for millions of years still haven't discovered all the unknown area. But with the efforts of scientists and explorers all over the world, we are able to discover those mysteries every day. Sorting Hat Spider This special appearance of the new spider species even attracted the author of Harry Potter, J.K. Rowling. And she expressed her admiration on Twitter about this newly discovered spider in India. It turns out that this new species of spider looks exactly like the magic sorting hat in Harry Potter. And the Indian arachnologists who discovered it happened to be fans of Harry Potter. Therefore, the three scientists named it as Ariovixia Gryffindori. It was discovered in the mountainous Western Ghats region of southwestern India. The special hat shape is actually the back of a spider, it is an oddly shaped brown patterned body that rises from a wide base to a tapered, bent peak above the spider's back. And this special shape helps to avoid being hunted by their predators. When on the ground, the spider can disguise as a dead leaf. When they are on the branch, as long as the spider don't move, it can be disguised as a dry leaf, making the birds unable to identify the spider and increase their chances of survival. Three-toed skink This superfluous creature was found in eastern Australia. When this creature was first discovered, researchers thought they were just an ordinary snake. It wasn't until they saw the feet that they realized that this might be a new species of lizard. This new lizard belongs to the family of skink. Currently, there are only 1,300 kinds of shink known. The characteristic of skink is that it does not have an obvious neck, and its legs are relatively small compared to normal lizards. The way they move seems like they are sliding through the ground. However, the characteristics of this new species are more obvious than that of the general skink. And the appearance is very close to a snake. Therefore, that explains why the researchers were unable to identify the creature in the first time. This is new species is called yellow-bellied three-toed skink. Its special parts is not only the appearance that resembles a snake, but what surprised scientists the most is that this skink has evolved two reproduction modes. Skinks that live by the sea reproduce by laying eggs. And the skink who lives on the mountain is viviparous. This discovery shocked many biologists. The question, how does the viviparous skink nourish the fetus in the body, making many biologists very curious. The Glowing Hawksbill Sea Turtle Hawksbill tortoise is an endangered species. The number of species in the world has been reduced by nearly 90% in the past 40 years. A New York marine biologist was photographing small sharks and coral reefs in the Solomon Islands. Suddenly an unexpected visitor arrived. It's a glowing hawksbill sea turtle. The marine biologist was shocked and immediately captured the footage. Although there are only a few minutes of the video, it is a historic moment. Because this is the first time in history that they have discovered reptiles can emit bioluminescence. Bioluminescence is often used to detect and attract prey, or used for defense and some form of communication. Bioluminescence is the ability to reflect the blue light hitting a surface and re-emit it as a different color. The most common colors are green, red, and orange. The reason why hawksbill sea turtle is emitting bioluminescence is mainly for defensive purpose. Because the sea area where hawksbill turtles exist have many bioluminescent creatures. Therefore, the ability to emit bioluminescence can better hide itself from its predators. This discovery of the glowing hawksbill turtle excites biologists and raises countless questions about the creature. And hopefully, scientists will able to answer them one by one in the near future. The pelican spiders. Also known as assassin spiders, and it's a living fossil. At first, scientists only able to know this spider through the amber found 50 million years ago. Until recent years, wild pelican spiders were accidentally found in remote forests of Madagascar. 
This spider has a very special appearance and looks like a pelican. The ordinary spider does not have a neck, but the pelican spider has evolved into a slender neck. Pelican spiders are active hunters. Rather than spinning their own webs, they prefer to stalk the trails of silk left behind by other spiders, scuttling around their leafy habitats. At night, pelican spiders follow these silky breadcrumbs, moving slowly and often upside down through the leaves. While the spider's six legs do the walking, their front two legs sweep through the air, feeling for prey. After finally reaching the edge of another spider's web, pelican spiders can wait for hours for the right time to strike. They will use the front legs to pull the spider web, making its owner thinks that a prey has fallen into the web. When the owner of the web shows up to look at the prey, the pelican spider will quickly strike with deadly efficiency. Swinging their calissary away from their bodies in a rapid 90-degree arc to stab the pincers into their prey. Due to the spider's long necks and pincers, they keep their prey held at a safe distance while injecting deadly venom into their preys. The special thing is that, although pelican spiders mainly prey on other spider, this kind of spider does not attack its own species. Scientists do not know exactly how pelican spiders are able to distinguish between different species of spiders. Initially guesses will be that the pelican spiders are able to identify different species through the different structure of their web. Electrophorus volti. An investigation into the diversity of electric eels has produced quite a shock. Rather than just one species, there are actually three species of electric eels living in South America, and one of them generates a bigger voltage than any other bioelectric animal. This new electric eel species was recently discovered at the bottom of the Amazon River. As biologists believe that there is only one kind of electrical eel in the world. The team of scientists used DNA analysis to study the Electrophorus volti. It was found that this creature can emit a voltage of 860 volts, far exceeding the highest record voltage of 650 volts in the past. And this makes it the strongest living bioelectricity generator we know of. These eels live in water with few dissolved minerals, meaning it has low conductivity. Which might be why such a large voltage is necessary. This electric discharge's ability can kill all kinds of fish in a split second. A shock of this size would be unlikely to kill a human, but it would cause muscle contractions and a painful numbing sensation, causing human to drown in water. National Geographic even credits this creature as the most feared freshwater animal on the planet because of its terrible electricity. After watching these newly discovered creatures, which one surprised you the most? Let me know in the comments section and comment what you want to see next. Thanks for watching to the end. If you like this type of content, please consider subscribing to this channel and like this video. We'll see you in the next video.